Gem Gems, how you doing? It's your girl here, Miss Hawaii. This is your general love reading for October 16th. It's good to see you guys. Let's get right into it. I hope you guys are having a really good weekend. Uh, personal readings, you can email me, Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. That's Miss Hawaii Readings at gmail.com. It does take one to two weeks to get you the reading. If you need it expedited, you're more than welcome to pay an expedited fee. And you'll have the reading by within 24 hours or by the next day. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. It's Miss Hawaii Tarot on Instagram. There's also a Facebook link below that will take you to the Facebook page. If you'd be so kind to go ahead and like that page. And of course, if you would like to become a member, don't forget to click that join button for membership access. I got a members reading coming from my members. If not tonight, you will definitely have it tomorrow is the latest. Click that join button for membership access. And there will also be an extended reading link in the description box below. If you feel like this reading is resonating and speaking to your heart and soul, go ahead and click that extended reading, which will take you over to Vimeo. All right, where I will pull your person's card, see how they feel about you and what actions they'll be taking moving forward. Thank you for all your donations. Your donations, I really, really, really appreciate it. Donation info is in the description box below if you would like to donate to this channel and you feel like it's been helping you and you would like to show support. Thank you for that. Also, thank you for all your kind emails. Those of you who send me support emails and those of you that have been inquiring about my birthday, which is October 31st. If you would like to send a birthday donation, you're more than welcome. I do not have a PO box and I do not put my address on YouTube. So you guys can't send me gifts, unfortunately. I am going to set up an Amazon wish list for my birthday. I'll probably do that tonight because I know some of you guys do want to actually send physical gifts. Um, so I will set that up tonight for you guys. But I love you guys. And thanks again for even considering wanting to send me something for my birthday. I appreciate that. All right, Gemini. So let's see what's going on with Gemini. How is Gemini feeling in love? How is Gemini feeling currently in love? How is Gemini feeling? Eight of cups. Oh, shit. Are you ready to abandon somebody ass? <laughs> Woo, you about to leave something, Gemini. You about to walk away hey, hey, with the Eight of Cups. You ready to walk away from somebody ass. Turn your back. Four of Pentacles. Okay, somebody could be clinging on to your energy, though. Um, Six of Wands. Okay, one more card. How Gemini is feeling in love. Wow, Gemini. Ten of Wands. Somebody's stressing you out. Death card here on the bottom. Could be a Scorpio you're dealing with. Um, Y'all ready to end something here. Y'all ready to end something here. With the Six of Wands, I feel like you, you either, you got like, you know that you deserve better. You know your worth. Like, you know that you're the shit. You know what I mean? This could also be something that you did want to succeed. You want it, you know, really bad. But something is going on here. Um... Either some of y'all feel like you're doing most of the work here in this connection. Show me how your person feel, Gemini. How your person feel? How does this person feel about Gemini? The three of swords in reverse. Okay. Some of y'all involved in a third party situation here. The knight of swords. Yeah, somebody can feel your energy, Gemini. Like you about to leave. Some of y'all dealing with another earth sign. I mean, another air sign. I don't know why I said earth. Maybe you are dealing with the earth sign. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but I meant to say air sign, another Gemini, an Aquarius or a Libra, the star in reverse, heavy Aquarian energy there with that card, um, yeah, your person is losing hope, I think your person can feel your energy here, um, trying to move away or trying to, to move on, um, last card for your person, the ace of wands, oh shit, so there's no major arcana, oh yeah, the star is here, and then we got the five of cups as the overall energy, Wow. Yeah, the only major arcana card here is on your person's side, the star in reverse. Um, overall energy is the... Something telling me to use this deck here. I don't know why. Uh, overall energy is the five of cups. That's about grief, sadness, disappointment, disappointment missing somebody, losing somebody. Um, let's see what's going on. Wow. Interesting energy. What's going on with Gemini? Who is Gemini walking away from? Why are they walking away? Oh, um, so could be somebody walked away from you. Temperance just threw itself at me. Some of y'all dealing with a Sagittarius. Some of y'all had patience for a while, maybe waited for this person to change. Some of y'all tried to fight for this, but you feel like this is the best step to take. Show me the Eight of Cups, please. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Why is the Eight of Cups here? The King of Cups. 
the six of cups wow and the knight of swords in reverse um with the strength card Woo! could be a leo some of y'all dealing with this person been putting you through it you love them i see love here i see good memories good times but something going on some of y'all has been some arguments um some of y'all this person could have actually got physically verb physically abusive with you or verbally abusive um Whatever the case may be, it's like it's been it's been it's been hard for you. For some of you, it's taken a lot of strength for you to actually finally walk away from this, because um, you do care about this person. Um, this could be somebody you've been hold, you've been holding on to for a long time. Show me the Four of Pentacles, please. Four of Pentacles, the Three of Cups, the Chariot in Reverse. Some of y'all, it's a Cancer, and the Ten of Swords in Reverse with the Sun card. So the sun card is about being illuminated, being able to see things clearly, have you, how you haven't been able to see them before. Some of y'all dealing with a Leo. Um, yeah, it's like, for some of y'all, it's like you try for a while here to try to make this work uh, with this person, but it could be that maybe there's been too many obstacles, too many, too much shit being thrown at y'all, and you kind of feel like with the chariot in reverse that it's, you know, it's not... Um, it's not working no more you know everything y'all been through is a little bit too much or whatever's been happening transpired has been a little bit too much for you to feel like you guys can proceed and have victory in this um yeah i don't see it defeating you i feel like you're you've healed i feel like you're handling it pretty well um show me the ten of swords in reverse the eight of swords yeah it's been on your mind you know what i mean you've been thinking about them a lot some of y'all this is a past person here a lot of good memories with this person. Show me the six of wands. The seven of swords in reverse. The judgment. Ooh. And the eight of pentacles in reverse with the knight of pentacles. So some of you are dealing with the earth sign. The Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um... I feel like, yeah, I feel like you know your worth, like I picked up on. I feel like you know your worth. Um, some of y'all, this person could have cheated or did something kind of deceptive towards you. King of Wands in reverse when I said that. So it could be another Aries, a Leo, a Sagittarius. Um, and I feel like you know your worth with that Six of Wands and the Judgment card and the Eight of Pentacles. It's like, I'm not putting no effort into this. I know what I'm, you know what I mean? I know I have a lot of self-awareness. You know what I'm saying? This person, whatever they did. Gemini like, mm -mm. show me the Ten of Wands. <laughs> the Strength card. Yeah, this person was getting on your nerve. I'm telling you, what they did got on your last nerves. They did something here. Six of Pentacles in reverse. Some of y'all did something with money. I am just got that. That's not for every Gemini. That's for a specific Gemini. Something with money went down or something just happened but i'm getting for a lot of you is just the weight of the relationship you've been carrying most of it on or connection you've been carrying most of it on your shoulders they keep pulling the strength you, you keep pulling the strength card like this person is putting you through it with the strength card when you see that that means somebody had to make you muster up some strength you know what i'm saying to deal with this shit with the ten of wands you got a crossroads here and a lot of y'all chose to cross that road let me see the three of swords in reverse. Your person now. Wow, Jim. The eight of cups in reverse. So your person ain't choosing to walk away. Oh, shit. Two of cups. Oh, shit. Your person like, no, I'm not going nowhere. <laughs> Notice you got the eight of cups upright. They get it in reverse. So your person said, no, this connection too strong. Mm, Queen of Wands in reverse, but some of y'all, they got somebody else. I'm telling you, for a lot of y'all, it's a third party situation, or for a lot of you, this person was trying to heal this. They trying to heal something here between you and them, and they feel like you either turned off by them now, they piss you off, they did something up in this bitch. Let me see the Knight of Swords. The four pentacles in reverse. The hangman in reverse. 
and the four of swords with the three of pentacles i don't know why i do not like gene Eichel's voice i'm sorry i don't it sounds too like whiny like a little girl i can't take it <laughs> i can't take it I, I don't like her voice oh uh, i know a lot of people like her so no disrespect to her but i just i'm not a fan of her music um eh, i can't take that no i like grown women singing <laughs> um yeah but it's like your person feel like you really you you done like some of y'all not even talking to this person but i don't see i don't see your person wanting to let this go i feel like they can feel your energy here um i feel like they clinging on to you you know what i'm saying uh let me see the star in reverse I saw your major arcana card, the lovers, looking at me too. Two of Pentacles in reverse. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Oh, God. The Four of Swords. Yeah, I keep seeing silence with the Ace of Cups, though. See, there's somebody here. They, they, they got a connection with you. They got feelings for you, but they are losing hope in this connection. And I think it's because of your energy. Um, they know that you're either about to drop them or you have dropped them. I'm seeing silence. Some of y'all haven't even talked to them. You haven't even responded or whatever. Um, they feel like you, they about to lose out on you. I'm going to tell you that right now. They feel like they about to lose out on you. Somebody who actually really, really fucking cared about them. Show me the Ace of Wands. And somebody that gave them bomb sex for some of y'all. The Chariot in reverse. There's that Cancer. Two of Swords in reverse. And the Six of Pentacles in reverse with the Nine of Wands in reverse. You see what I'm saying? But it's still an energy of King of Swords in reverse. Gemini ain't playing. Gemini. <laughs> Some of y'all blocked this person. It's like this person wants this. Some of y'all, only thing they can give you is sex, dick or pussy. And it's like, that's not what you want. Like. I keep seeing the six of pentacles in reverse, which is like an unequal give and take. Somebody was giving more to this connection. Yeah. Wow. Mm. Your person losing hope. They trying to hold on to God's unchanging hand. Give me three Kipper cards here for this person dealing with Gemini. False person came out. Oh, shit. So some of y'all, this person did some fake shit, Jim. And that could be why y'all like, bye. They could have did some fake shit here. Sudden wealth is here. Okay. That's been coming out a lot. That's my jackpot card. Like this person, I feel like they hit the jackpot with you. I told you, some of y'all, some of this got to do with money. That's not for everybody, but for a specific Gemini, something went down with some money. Like this person didn't give you money they said they were supposed to give you, or they took something from you, or they like to gamble, or something with money. And you got a gift here. Oh, shit. Maybe this person think about trying to get you a gift to try to get in your good graces. Thoughts is here. They think about this a lot. Some of y'all, they should have been thinking about you first instead of thinking about somebody else. Um, but yeah. Some of y'all, you got some money or something and this person, that's why this person was trying to get close to you or something like that. Or some of y'all, they wanted something out of you I'm getting. I don't know what this shit is about. Fucking don't know, Gemini. But this shit deep right here. Let's go into the extended, okay? I'm going to pull your person's cards. See how they feel about you, what actions they're going to be taking moving forward towards you. And I'll also get advice for you from the universe and see what is going on, Jim Jims. I love y'all. Thanks for watching. I hope y'all have a great weekend. I'll see you guys in the extended. If not, I'll see you guys next time. Deuces. I love ya.